Hey, let me show you how you can fix the battery drain issue on your CMF Phone 1. So first of all, I will start from the settings. And now uh, let's go into the Google. It's located here. Open it. Now let me just rotate the screen, okay? Then we have to go for the all services. Now you will have to go into the devices and sharing. Click on the devices. And in the next screen, you will have to actually get rid of the devices scanning. So just wait for the loading screen. Okay, it actually takes too much time for some reason. But basically, it's not opening in my case, but if it open, just unselect the switcher for Nervi devices scanning. It's just taking your battery. And then we can go back and we have to go for the privacy, which will be located here, security and the privacy. Now we have to tap scrolling and move move for the more security and the privacy. Right now we will have to go for the usage and diagnostics and simply get rid of this function. So it's also not gonna drain your battery. In this step we have to go back. Now we have to move for connected devices. Go for the connection preferences and now go for the printing. And be sure that you switch off the default print service which is actually scanning for Nerby printers all the time then we have to go back from this one and reach for the location there we can find it go to the location services and be sure that you remove the wi-fi scanning and also the bluetooth scanning also it's important to switch off the location when you are not using location so when you are sitting in your home you don't need to use the location so be sure that you turn it off because it's draining your battery then go into the display where I can highly recommend you to enable the dark theme. Also change the screen timeout. So as you can see in my case, I've got 10 minutes. But of course, if you often forgot to switch off your screen, then it will be turned for like 10 minutes. So it's better actually to get 15 seconds, 30 seconds or even one minute. Just keep it in mind. Also be sure that you adjust the brightness level. You can do this like manually or automatically with the adaptive brightness. So it's actually changing the brightness level according to the current brightness around you. And also go for the HDR display, switch it off, go to the display refresh rate and set, set 60 Hertz. Now go into the battery, which will be located at the top. There we go. Go for the battery saver and you can just turn it on. Next, it's also recommended to switch off the 5G network or mobile data. So if you are connected to the Wi-Fi, you can switch off the mobile data. And if you are outside and you are using mobile data, you can switch off the Wi-Fi. So be sure that you actually do this. Of course, in this video, I'm using the Wi-Fi. So this is the reason why I'm not going to actually get rid of it. And the same with the Bluetooth. When you are not using Bluetooth devices, you can just open the bar, click on the Bluetooth icon, and it will be turned it off. And this is it for this video, the all tips to improve the battery life on this device. Right now, please subscribe.